Okay, I'm going to multiply a three digit number by a one digit number, so 732 multiplied by 8. So again, I'm going to round 732 so I can um, make an estimate. So the nearest 100 is 700. So 700 multiplied by 8 is a lot easier to do. So 7 times 8 is 56. So 700 times six, uh, 8 is 5,600. So 100 times bigger. Right, the next thing I do is I'm going to partition 732 onto my grid. So 700, 30, and 2. That's going to be multiplied by 8. So first of all, 700 times 8. So again, 7 times 8 is 56. 700 times 8 is 100 times bigger. So it's 5,600. 5,600. Again, thinking about thousands, hundreds, tens and units. This is useful later. 30 times 8. Or 3 times 8 is 24. 30 times 8 is 240, so 240. And then finally, 2 times 8 is 16, so making sure it's the tens and units. And now for a column addition method. Zero at zero at six is six. Zero tens add four tens add one ten. Five tens so that's fifty. Six hundred add two hundred is eight hundred. And five thousand at zero at zero is five thousand. So my final answer is five thousand eight hundred and fifty six. And again, that's reasonably close to my estimate, so it gives me a good idea that my calculation must be correct.